No, nobody's got guns here. You only you guys. Oh, okay. And if, the, if you know that, you don't know that. You guys have. As we had seven people shot in downtown last. Medical, my my medicine. Okay. okay. You're speaking. <laughs> you're you public. What? You have my name and my business oh, card. Why are you getting close? And and I Turn never. Turn on yourself and look at what a fool you look like. Sir, every. Greetings. Blackheart Knight here. Today we follow Ass Elmo and Whiskboy around as they try to educate an officer on the First Amendment, but they fail to even understand any of the Constitution whatsoever. Let's watch. I'm wondering if you could tell me the five points of the First Amendment. I was just wondering if you, you could tell me. Sir. I was wondering if you could tell me the five points of the First Amendment. Sir. Yeah. Could you could you let him speak? Where do you need to go? I'm, I'm done talking. If you need directions or you need medical attention, I'll get you some. Why are you angry at us? I'm not angry at all, sir. What? Is, is that is that the way that, that you treat the public? I'm not treating you poorly, sir. I asked you a question. I'm not answering your question. I asked you need directions or medical Be attention. Before being a police officer, you're a man, right? So you know how to respect men, right? We're done talking, sir. Oh, we're done talking. Yes, uh, if we if weren't, don't need if, medical attention if, if you weren't at work, we'd be done talking. But you're at work, sir. I'm not required to answer the five, the five whatever your question is. But you're supposed to respect it. I, I respect it, but I'm okay. not answering it. Okay, okay? sir. So because I'm not going to answer it. All right. I'm not being set up for your failure. Oh, Froninger, he knows why you're there, and he's not going to make it easy on you. I'm not, no, I'm not, no, you're not setting me up. Okay, that's, that's not going to happen. So that's you have fine. a good night. Good that's night. fine. So our failure? Listen, you I guys are the one that fail every time in our sure, videos. That's great. The biggest reason why they fail is because you set it up as a loaded question fallacy. No matter what they answer they give, they're always wrong, and you're always right. Have a good night, sir. You so we've already had conversations several times, you and I. Good. Aren't you, aren't you, don't you, you've been arrested, correct? I've been arrested, yeah. yes. For what? For, For what? having cannabis in the parking garage? <laughs> no, I wasn't arrested. Uh, you guys are such losers. So, so, my turn. So, if this cop knew anything, he would realize that the war on drugs didn't get the constitutional amendment that prohibition did. And therefore, I, therefore, the war on drugs Why are you is, raising your voice, sir? Because, because it's the it's, first amendment. I'm making a dramatic plea, in a passion plea, the fact that you don't even know the constitution. Yes, that was the 18th Amendment, which was ratified in 1919, which sparked the prohibition era and the era of gangsters, which, funnily enough, that era also cost the lives of more cops than in any other period in U.S. history. And 14 years after it was ratified, the 21st Amendment ended it. And you're bragging about the fact that you arrest someone for weed when George Washington, to... George Washington had weed. Would you arrest George Washington for weed? <laughs> okay. Yes, you would. Let me, let, let me tell him about sir. something. Uh, let me, let, it's let, still not illegal now, but we'll, let me, we never get a constitutional amendment. They needed a constitutional amendment to pass prohibition. The drug war didn't happen. They got it directly from the United Nations and Richard That's Nixon. You're talking about we? Fact. You're talking That's about undeniable fact. Hey. You're right, officer. That is his own interpretation of what he thinks the laws are. But the tenth, but the tenth amendment allows for the states to uh, create laws that are not covered within the Constitution, which is why there's so many varying drug laws throughout the United States. And it seems to be something he will not cover in any of his videos. It means means a lot. Means a lot coming from the steroid guy. <laughs> Prove that I use steroids. Yeah. Prove that I use steroids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I take a drug test. Yeah, 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 every yeah, yeah. Year. The steroid guy. Everybody knows about you around here. What about me? Yeah. Are you trying to get my attention? You everybody, guy, everybody. I don't use steroids. So he can yeah. talk for so, so, so long. But when you ask him the First Amendment. No, no, no. I know what the First Amendment. Is. No, the thing speech. is, the thing. What else? The thing I'm is, not, I'm not entertaining <laughs> you. Let me talk. The, th the thing is, sir, night, I'm not sir. ashamed of smoking weed. I love weed. Okay, good. I'm I love weed. And guess what? I have a I have a prescription from my doctor. Okay. Do you want Do you want to Do you want to violate my Fourth Amendment or the no, HIPAA law or anything? anything about that. So why are you speaking about my medication? Because you're you're, you're violating. Doctor. You're vi You're violating. Yes, our buddies from the First Amendment. You you're you're violating. The, you're violating the HIPAA law. I'm not saying anything. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. You're, you're talking about my medical my my medicine. You, okay, okay. You're speaking. <laughs> you're you know public. What? You have my name and my business oh, card. Why are you getting close? Oh! 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 Sue you? How? If I'm How? You're a cop. Law, you're a cop. And I'm you're a cop. You guys get away with murder. Okay, have a good night. You guys get away with murder. And this is what happens. This guy will talk on and on and on about anything but the Constitution. He says the First Amendment is your freedom of speech. Yeah, that's one. I don't but, want to talk to you. I just, but guess what? You you're need medical here. attention or police attention. But you, you, but you said you didn't want to talk, but you kept talking, but it wasn't about the First Amendment. And you're sitting here as a sergeant when there's a murder on the loose. There's no, been no murder. Hey, dumbass, I bet you didn't know that cops don't investigate murders all the time. Some make it assignments for guard duty. Did you ever think about that, you moron? No 
someone died last night. But somebody, somebody, no there, there was a shooting. There's no cold cases? Well, there are. Oh, okay, okay, thank you. And is that what I'm doing here right now? I'm keeping the peace. Sir, how, and you how, guys are no, me from keeping no, the peace. No, 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 no. Now you're trying to frame us with a charge. No, Hold sir. on. No, Hold sir. on. I'm keeping Hold the peace. Don't Hold on. Don't frame me with anything. Uh, you listen, came and approached me. I listen, can't approach you. listen. How do you how do you get that big sleeping eight hours a day and working eight hours a day? Do you have a family and children that you take care of? How do you get that big? Excuse me. How do you get that big? You don't get that big by you by ever, eating. Have you ever heard the term genetics? No, sir. <laughs> you serious? Are you that freaking? Stupid that you don't know that some people can be naturally big without the resorting to using steroids. I mean, there's dumb and then there's just flat out plain stupid. You're a complete idiot if you don't know that. Okay. No, well, explain it to me. Night. Explain it to me. You have a good night. Give me your give, give me your justification. Talking. We are done talking. Well, you want to talk about uh, you want to talk about my we talking 50 minutes ago and you talk about anything besides the First Amendment. All I want uh, this guy wants to speak about me smoking weed. When, when, when he's all buffed up out of nowhere. Well, he takes prescription <laughs> pills. He drinks alcohol. Those are far more dangerous. Marijuana that's has that, never killed anybody, that, ever. That's where his anger comes from, the, ster the I'm steroids. I'm not angry, sir. I've not raised my voice. Yes, you are. You're okay. angry that we're here. You are. Aren't you supposed to beat some eggs with that? Well, thank you, officer, for pointing out that whisk for us. I know it's your gimmick, dude, but you know what it makes you look like? Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna go beat some ovaries with this. Okay. Do whatever you need to do. <laughs> no, sir. That, that was that was funny. But, sir, we're not here to give you a hard, a hard time. But you see, you want to. All wanna... you've done is give me a hard time. No, sir. I, I want to say one have thing. I ever you and I have had several interactions. Have I disrespected you? Peaceful. Peaceful. Okay. I'm peaceful now. Okay. I'm done talking to you. Have turn. a good night. How many more? How many more likes do you have to have for followers? Sir, we have to we have to continue doing this. It's not about likes or followers. It's about the First Amendment. What is this fixation you have on on just the First Amendment? You do realize there's a total of 27 amendments and seven articles within the Constitution, right, dumbass? It's, it's about what? It's about it's no sir, no sir. I'm getting uh, you guys are calling the attention on yourself. You see, I'm not the one on the video. You are, and and I never on yourself and look at what a fool you look like. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's seen me before. Yeah, I know. You know why? You never because see. All you hear is your mouth. It doesn't. That's because that's part of the First Amendment, sir. Right. And I don't and want to speak to you. You have that's to. That's part of my First Amendment. No, but you have to respect. Yes, you I've do. I've already asked you if you need You're a public attention. servant. We're police attention. You're a public you servant. Do. I'm serving you, and I've already served you. So, so speaking, to me, speaking to me. I provided my name. Speaking to me. My employee number is 19033. Good. But, but remember, speaking to me is part of your job. I've already spoken to you. Okay. Please, please take care of yourself. I've spoken to you. That's fine. I'm not harassing him. Have I said he said he said about me smoking weed, and then I said something about him doing steroids? What? You know what I'm saying? Did I do anything different that you didn't? No. You trying to embarrass me in front of my viewers? You have done that yourself. Listen, this is the problem. We've asked thousands of officers across this country. I didn't go up to you. I I was, I was well within my rights to go up to you, swear and yell. I just said, hey, can you tell me the First Amendment? And I told you I didn't want to speak to you unless you had a medical emergency or a police emergency, correct? Yeah, this cop doesn't have to speak to you at all. If you're being antagonistic, he can just walk off and prevent any further incidents from occurring. Sir, do you need directions? I tell you something. You don't have the privilege. You, need to report a crime. you don't have the privilege to treat us with with I that know. attitude. Your body language. Okay. You're all sweating. Because you're I, more it's hot out here, sir. It's 100 degrees. I hear humidity. You. I hear. 100 humidity. I hear. And I'm wearing 40 pounds of gear. All right. Well, okay. maybe maybe you should loosen some up because no, nobody's got guns here. You only you guys. <laughs> yeah. How do you know that? This is Florida, after all. There's a lot of people with CCWs, so you never know who's packing. Oh, okay. And if, if you know that, you don't know that. You guys have... As we had seven people shot in downtown last night. Did you night. catch the bad guy? No, we didn't. Okay, we well, why didn't you go over there? Why are you doing here? Drinking because water in front of the club? Working. Sir. Wouldn't it be more they wouldn't catch them over there either. We didn't catch them on every... But we, we have assignments. We have assignments. So this is what happens. We are disciplined. Because Yes, this officer has a job, and in a job, you have assignments, and if you don't do those assignments, they can and will find somebody who will, and you'll be in the unemployment line if you don't fulfill your duties at, in that job. They're disciplined, so disciplined, in fact, they got cops on every corner, still can't find the murderer, still can't find the guy who, let's go. And that's the walk of shame, guys. 
No, that's the walk of somebody who's had enough of your bullshit. All you've been is on nothing more than antagonistic and con confrontational. And if he had decided to do something, uh, there would be nothing you could do about it because you're a small fry, I am. Well, that wraps it up here, folks. What we learned here today is that Wisp Boy is nothing more than a complete moron who has no idea what the Constitution says. Well, that wraps it up here, folks. Have a good night, a good day, or whatever. And don't forget to rate, comment, share, and subscribe, and I appreciate you watching. Thank you very much.